I am Mateo Kovacic and this is my Like a Pro. Brings that, that roll across his body. Kovacic might be able to play. Yes! Mateo Kovacic with his first ever goal at Stamford Bridge. A big moment for Kovacic. He scores at the bridge for the very first time. My love for football began, I think, the first time I touched the ball. When I was a child, I always had a ball with me. I slept with the ball and for me there was nothing else than, than playing football. Many people ask always, what did you want when you were a child? For me, there was always just to be a football player. It's just the thing that I loved the most and that I felt comfortable with. When you were on the pitch, I felt like free. So this was the only thing that came into my mind, what would I like to be when I grow up. So when I first came to nursery, I was around five years old. I was just quicker than the other kids. And when we played football, I was more comfortable with the ball than them. I just loved it maybe more, more than the others. When I was a child, they always told us don't look too much at the ball, to always see the pitch, to try to find your teammate in a better solution. So maybe these are the advices that I tried to keep working on from a small age. From every coach, I take always the positive things and I had the, the luck in my career to have a lot of great coaches also when I was young. So the thing that always uh, remained was what my father said. Enjoy and don't put pressure on yourself and everything will be good. So enjoy is the key word for me. What a lovely Brilliant. little piece of skill from Kovacic. Three of them left bamboozled by that. Oh, what a turn. Signal out about that from Mateo Kovacic. When I was a child, it's obviously more about enjoying. But back then I was also about winning because in football and in every sport you just want to win. But now I think it's a mix because in the end you need to win titles to win games and especially if you are on such a level as we are here on Chelsea. So I think these two things is a, is a great mixture to enjoy yourself on the pitch but also to be very serious and to try to give your best to win. I just loved football so much that I never felt it as a sacrifice. For me, it was just a pleasure to be on the pitch, to go training every day. It doesn't matter if it was two, three, four, five hours. I just wanted to have the possibility and the ability to play football. It's a, it's a tough sport, obviously, when I was 14. I had a big injury, I broke my leg when I guy came with a bad tackle and this was maybe my biggest hurdle because I was uh, one, one year without playing football and like to come back at such an age was not so easy, but I just uh, wanted always to become a football player. I gave everything this year to, to come back stronger and that's what happened. I, I become much, much physically stronger and mentally as well. The biggest advice for me is that nobody puts pressure on you because many parents are pushing pressure on, on their kids and the kids, they don't enjoy football the, the way they should. They just should uh, love the game, enjoy it, and obviously with enjoy it, then comes the seriousness and to become a bigger player, to start to win games. But from the young age, they should just enjoy the sport, love it, and do everything to, to be good on the pitch. That's fantastic. Thanks for that, Thank you very much.